What is up fishing addicts? On today's video, we will be checking out the Muskie Expo in Chicago 2020 at the Mega Center over here or Renaissance Center. I forgot what was it called. Um, but whatever. Um, I was actually there. I forgot to record the intro and I didn't want to put my camera on because uh, I wasn't sure of uh, if I'm going to like it or it's going to be video worthy. But uh, it is actually a pretty good deal. Even if you're a bass guy, there is pretty good deals out there, man. Um, I, I picked up a bunch of Rapalas for uh, four dollars and they're usually nine ten dollar baits uh and uh some cool looking baits that um i'm probably pretty sure never will use them but uh i'll be hanging on my wall or remove the hooks cut the hooks and uh give it to my kid to chew on them or uh chase me around beat me with them um but uh pretty nice uh expo um i was a little bit disappointed on how expensive lee's baits were holy moly i mean like holy moly even for J uh, even my jdm guys were like ah oh, yeah that's pricey <laughs> and uh those guys throw like 40 50 dollar lures all the time and uh when they snag a mega bass they're like oh well we'll just get another one or i hope they have it in uh in lease uh global tank or whatever but um uh, it was pretty amazing uh i'll, I'll link the video um, I'll play the video in a second, but if you haven't subscribed to my channel guys hit that subscribe button fishing season is almost two months away So it will be a lot of a lot of fishing videos coming up shortly and unfortunately, I don't think we're gonna have any ice fishing season But uh, if we ever get the uh, safe ice this year, um, I will hit it up with uh, That's it. We're going fishing and uh, not skunk fishing and make a pretty video. I will probably harass them for the whole remaining trip but uh whatever um no well, so let's go check it out i i only showed up a couple of boots that uh i thought they were worth checking out and unique so um enjoy the short video nice. so here look at the huge baits of foot long it's pretty amazing looking baits and actually i do have the rod to cast one of those bad boys I wonder what's the price tag on these. Uh. Holy crap, it's only $36. Yeah, look at that. $36. Man, I don't know now, I'm tempted to buy one. Guys, do you guys think I should uh, I should buy one? Let me know down below in the comments. Or uh, maybe we try to catch a bass with one of these big lures. See how that's gonna work out. Look at these bulldogs. I mean the medusas. I actually have a couple one of these, and uh, had a pretty unique one that came with the spinners. Is a storm there, not, nothing that impressive now, but this thing, this thing will definitely catch bass. Pretty good price too. Very light though. Whopper poppers. What are you pulling it with? Excuse me? Uh, three quarter ton suburban? Now I've seen these. Actually, I have one of these. These are pretty cool and they do make good action. I've been looking for those. I, I didn't, never knew where they got them. But I guess these guys have it. Maybe I'll get one or two if the price is right. Oh yeah, most definitely I'll get one of these. These are pretty nice. I've got uh, quite a few muskies with these and a pike. And uh, if you're down south, you can catch pretty nice bass with these as well.
These are pretty unique. He has a shovel head. So it's gonna be like a chatterbait almost. I wonder how much are these? Yeah, I think I should I think I should buy one of these for sure. They're not that expensive. For twenty-four bucks. For sure. Let me see what else they have. Big cranks. Looks like they made out of balsa wood, but they're re very reasonably priced over here. Super nice. Big cooks, sharp. 30 bucks. Pretty cool bait. Yes. Bargain bin. Look at that savage gear for 24 bucks. You know, I bought something similar like this from Germany when I was over there, and it was almost triple the price. I love Savage Gear. They, they, their base work pretty well. That's a pretty big bait. Hefty price, though. Let's see what else they have. Big Bucktails. I don't know guys, it's a lot of, it's a lot of choices, but uh, I'm not a musky guy, so I'm not gonna break the budget. I'm way over hundred dollars right now. But these things look very tempting. I don't know, there's uh, one more boot I wanna show you guys that actually had a lot of good deals. Um, so let's go check it out over there and uh, we'll come back see what what else we have over here guys over here got some pretty neat spinner baits pretty cool it's called uh, choice snagger baits pretty amazing uh, spinners Actually, these, these will work pretty well with bass. And uh, from the looks of it, there's weed guards. That's, that's pretty unique, if you guys ask me. They're not that heavy, but they have weed guards on them. Pretty nice setup. Look at that. Pretty cool. I, I was over here early in the morning and I didn't even notice that, that they come with uh, weed guards. And uh, looks like they all, they can make you a spinner right on the spot. Pretty crafty. And I can't justify the price point. But... Uh, Pretty sick looking baits. And uh, guys, if you guys haven't checked out uh, uh, the Angler's Outlet, they have a pretty, pretty sick deal over here. They got the Rapalas. They have the Rapalas for four bucks, which I already got some. The Shad Deeps. Uh, they run about nine dollars, ten dollars, and they got some lucky crap. And uh, the bait that got my attention was uh, the frog from uh, Weston. I also have purchased one of those. It's a uh, pretty sick looking frogs. Look at these. These are amazing. I got a couple of these. 
for sure will it'll be great for the DuPage River small mount. That's awesome for small mount. Oh yeah, they look pretty nice. Yes. I just got uh, the black and uh, white one. Oh, okay. Sharp hooks too. Very sharp. <laughs> Thanks, I appreciate it. Yeah. Yeah, pretty decent, guys. If you guys are interested in frogs, I will strongly recommend these from Weston. And uh, you guys have an online store, right? Pardon? You guys have an online store where people can purchase them? I don't think so. No? no. Where can they find your products? Embedded dealers. Embedded dealers? Yeah. It's pretty nice. I'm pretty sure this will catch on. Yes. Yeah. So the yeah, I already got them from him. Yeah, I got the black and uh, white one. So, um, like I said, uh, Angler's Outlet in Niles, they'll have them. Um, I'm pretty sure once they catch on, uh, it'll be all over. But uh, these were the pretty pretty decent uh, stuff that I was uh, getting from Musky, uh, from the Musky Expo. And also, these guys over here in this book, there's a lot of baits that... Uh, are real expensive, but over here you can get them uh, two for twenty-five. So I got a couple. I picked up a couple of these. I'm not uh, used to recording with my phone. Uh, the price was pretty decent, and uh, I got, I picked up a couple of those from there. And uh, I was looking for lease. I mean, the prices were extremely, extremely high. But uh, I checked them out too. It just, uh, I couldn't justify the prices. And uh, I lost my buddy. Well, that's it, guys. I'm going to let you guys go. Let me know what you think about the Muskie Show. And uh, hopefully, I'll see you guys on the Chicago Outdoors Expo next week. I'll be on the boot of KBL. So I hope you guys uh, come and say hi. And uh, that's it, guys. I'll catch you guys on the next one.